you are listening to KSG podcast this is a short crisp concise exam oriented edited editorial for civil services aspirants in this podcast we are going to talk about india getting world's first liquid mirror telescope source for the content is anjali marar's article for the indian express in early 2022 india's first liquid mirror telescope which will observe asteroids supernovae space debris and all other celestial objects from an altitude of 2450 meters in the himalayas so its first light as it peered into the zenith from the devasthal observatory in uttarakhand having entered the commissioning phase it became the world's first liquid mirror telescope to be commissioned for astronomy now let us explain what the telescope is how it is different from a conventional one and what its uses are the international liquid mirror telescope that is ilmt has been set up at the devasthal observatory campus owned by aryabhatta research institute of observation sciences nainital in uttarakhand located at 2450 meters above mean sea level there are two firsts with this it's the only one to have been developed for astronomy research and is also the only one of its kind to be operational anywhere in the world the handful of liquid telescopes that were previously built either tracked satellites or were deployed for military purposes ilmt will be the third telescope facility to come up at devasthal one of the world's pristine sites for obtaining astronomical observations with with ILMT set to commence full scale scientific operations in October this year it will work along with the 3.6 meter devasthal optical telescope that is dot the largest telescopes operating in india also operating at the location is the 1.3 meter devasthal fast optical telescope inaugurated in 2010 now how is it different from a conventional telescope A conventional telescope is steered to point towards the celestial source of interest in the sky for observations. The liquid mirror telescopes, on the other hand, are stationary telescopes that image a strip of the sky which is at the zenith at a given point of time in the night. In other words, a liquid mirror telescope will survey and capture any and all possible celestial objects from stars, galaxies, supernova explosions, asteroids to space debris. Conventional telescopes have highly polished glass mirrors, either single or a combination of curved ones that are steered in a controlled fashion to focus onto the targeted celestial object on specific nights. The light is then reflected to create images. As opposed to this, as is evident by the name, the liquid telescope is made up of mirrors with a reflective liquid, in this case mercury, a metal which has a high light reflecting capacity. About 50 liters of mercury filled into a container will be rotated at a fixed constant speed along the vertical axis of the ILMT. During this process, the mercury will spread as a thin layer in the container forming a paraboloid shaped reflecting surface which will now act as the mirror. Such a surface is ideal to collect and focus light. The mirror has a diameter of 4 meter. Now another difference between the two is their operational time. While conventional telescopes observe specific stellar sources for fixed hours as per the studied requirement and time allotted by the respective telescope time allotment committee, ILMT will capture the sky's images on all nights between two successive twilights for the next 5 years starting October 2022.